hey y'all welcome back to my channel so in today's video we'll be revamping a wig and we're talking about starting a revamp or wig revamp business um so this wig was torn into two like the closure area was torn in half so i'm just gonna reconstruct it so instead of just taking out the whole closure i'm just gonna replace a little bit of um lace in the middle area like i'm doing right now i'm gonna sew it into the new lace that i have with me yeah so today's video we're just going to talk about starting the laundry or hair laundry business as we all know closures and fronters are so expensive and a lot of us have wigs that has issues but you don't know how to go about it so if you're out there watching this video i think you can uh, and you're thinking of any business you can start i would advise you to start like a hair laundry business washing off wigs changing up the closure changing up the front as you can see this week i'm not going to do too much on it all i did was just to change just to add a little lace in the front area then replacing it with um a new one like i'm doing right now so if you don't see this video to hit that subscribe button for a girl give this video a thumbs up comment down below you know you know how we do girl so let's get this party started here Like I said before, I'm not doing so much on this wig. As you can see, I didn't take out the old closure that was on the wig before. I didn't do that, so I just I'm just adding my own lace. So you see, revamping is just very easy to do. You're not basically going to be ventilating the whole um closure. There's not much to do when all I can is thinking about you, not doing well. can be very frustrating i know when i started i was frustrated so many times like 
or I almost gave up, you know, but with consistency and, you know, patience, when you get a hold on it, guys, I trust me, you just want to ventilate anything, you know, so you have to be patient. And when you start, don't do like, I have to finish this thing like today, today, and no, you have to you take your time. You know, this hair took me about two hours, yeah, two hours. I took break because I like to take a break when i'm ventilating when you sit down there that you want to finish the whole hair in the sitting trust me you get bored and get frustrated it gets really boring trust me doing ventilating so it's like half of the hair done i've done half of the hair you can see the um middle the pattern is so defined already so yeah this is what you know so um in between doing this um hair I had to um, go out to pick up my kids from school. So this is me stepping out to pick up my kids. You know, I see you have to take breaks. Stepping out to pick up my kids from school. Yeah. So after school run i came back again to finish up you know so you, you just have to just be patient don't rush it take your time you know so yeah i ended up finishing it in less than 30 minutes yeah and that's it guys so if you're thinking of starting a hair revamp business i would say yes it's a good business people have lots and lots of food they want to revamp like as I am talking right now, I have a wig. I need to redo my own wig. So, people's wigs need to be done. And they need you out there to help them. So, if you're thinking of starting a wig laundry business, I'll say you should go ahead. It's a good business. You don't need any setup at all. All you need is your ventilating pin, your wig head, and your lace. And girl, you can do it in the comfort of your home. You don't need a store. Just do it from your house and your business will boom. Trust me. Think big i wanna wake up with you in my